Okay, everyone. Thanks so much for joining and watching. We are entering the Shark Reef at Mandalay Bay. And I'm bringing y'all along with me. They are practicing social distancing as well as you do have to wear your masks at all times. Oh boy, I was looking for him and there he is right there. Crocodile with some fish hanging out there. This is gorgeous. I can't tell you first of all how warm it is in here. <laughs> It is quite humid, steamy, like you are in the tropics. Oh boy, there's another one. Just kind of hanging out there. Oh, and another one. Just keep popping out, surprising me. Lots of fishies. All right, and this is supposed to be a Komodo dragon. Oh boy, and there he is. He's a big guy. It says that their Komodo dragon came from the largest single group of captive-born dragons hatched in the U.S. There were 28 of them total. Crazy. More fish? I feel like I'm in Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom is what it's designed like. Oh boy. That is one big snake right there. Super large fish. Oh, and there's a sea turtle. Look at that. And I'd like to show you guys, this is the end of the snake. And um, that's one. And then uh, here's another one. Pretty big snake, man. All right, guys. Okay, we've got more people approaching now. And these are some mighty big fish here. Fish there. <laughs> oh, look at the stingray. Oh, well, hello there. <laughs> look at that. It's very cool. So these are the freshwater fish currently. So this is the razorback catfish we just saw. As well as the stingray. That awesome design on it. That was just so cool. Look at this fish. That is a big fish. But I've never seen a stingray with designs like that. It's just too cool. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm well, thanks. How are you? I'm well. Where Good. are you from? Kalamazoo, Michigan. Very nice. <laughs> 
a little chilly there right now, so I'm enjoying this. Well, I have some good news for you. Yeah? Because you live in Michigan. Yeah. You can have a pet piranha. Oh, fantastic. I know you want <laughs> I can see you having one. Yes, I have now. that desire, right? I can see by your eyes. <laughs> your eyes. Right, right? I got piranha look. Oh, boy. Yeah, no thanks. You ever seen piranhas before? I have. What do you think of them? They're feisty. <laughs> they can be. Yeah. They're also skittish, too. Really? Huh. Really skittish fish. And they do well with those other fish in there, or are those babies? No, these are buck tooth catchers. They don't go after them. Okay. Okay. They're too fast. They can't catch them. Really? Huh. Very interesting. This is gorgeous. Thank you. So, what would happen if you walked in the water with Piranha? What do you think they would do? Um, I probably wouldn't walk out. Nothing would happen. No? We're bigger than they are. We're afraid of it. Hmm, so that's just a myth. Okay. They never kill a human. They could bite you if you bleed it. They could eat you if you're dead. Right. If you're not injured or dead, you go in the water, you're fine. Oh. They like fingers. I was going to say, I'm not going to test that theory. <laughs> no, you can walk in the water. <laughs> sure, sure. Nothing would happen. Okay. But not fingers. Not fingers by themselves. Really? Yes. Look at those fish in my fingers. They're bigger than my fingers. Yep. Yep, They're for sure. They're bigger than my hand. Right. They're not bigger than my arm. Right. But they're bigger than those two Wow. Well, great info. Thank you so That's much. And that was everything you'd want to know about a piranha. <laughs> but we move on. And again, did I say Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom? I feel like Indiana Jones is going to pop out at any time now. <laughs> All right. I don't see him in here. So we are going to move on. So I believe it is safe to say we have moved on to salt water. This is very cool, guys. All right, and we move on. It is hard to believe that we are in the heart of Las Vegas on the strip right now. This is just very cool. Does a little look up above. It's very cool. It's a 
beautiful fish. So again, on my journey here, that I'm doing everything on a dime, I was able to get a free pass into the Shark Reef today. Again, courtesy of the My Vegas Slot Game. You guys, I'm telling you, it's amazing. You can do lots of things, get lots of free stuff on there at zero cost. Let's move on. Okay, so now they are all around us. Sharks sure, swimming over us. Say once this was a petting area but again due to social distancing it doesn't appear as if it's open it does say it was a touch pool and here's a lion fish Beautiful jellyfish. Finding Nemo. <laughs> so gorgeous. So many of them. Oh, all right, guys. We have a starfish, several of them. Look at that. So cool.
So cool. Look at them all. Gonna move on to Neptune's Fury. Looks like we may see a shark ray, a bowmouth guitar fish, green sea turtle. Let's see what we can see, guys. And yeah, social distance at the same time. the sounds that makes it sound like you are underwater and the boat is sinking without people screaming <laughs> and there it is look at them all oh this is a big guy <laughs> and look at we are a boat underwater a sunken ship. Hmm. Hey, shark. This is very cool, guys. Yeah, I see that jump box. Okay, we're gonna move on. Be right back. There's the sea turtle. You do this thing. Hey, that turtle big as them sharks, bro. Right? Oh my god, look at the You see that turtle as big as the sharks? Oh, he opened his mouth. Look at the teeth. Oh, he. And we are at the exit of the Shark Reef Aquarium at Mandalay Bay. It says the sand tiger sharks in the shipwreck exhibit have so many teeth that they can't close their mouths. That's why their mouths are open. Some sharks may lose and replace 50,000 teeth throughout their lifetime. But just wanted to thank y'all for coming along with me. And again, this was the Shark Reef Aquarium at Mandalay Bay. Keep following, lots more to come. Thanks, you guys. I appreciate y'all. Talk to you soon. Bye.